Hi everyone, my name is Chinmay Amin. I'm from Team 1514, the Vikes, Western American Collegiate Institute. And today I'll be teaching you how to code in uh, LabVIEW. Software I'm, that I'm going to be using is the one provided in the 2011-2012 season. So let's get started. This is tutorial one, and I'll be just I'll just cover the basic layout and format of the LabVIEW. Okay, so whenever you want to create a new robot project to run on your robot on your compact video, you have to click on the second link called FRC Studio Robot Project. So I'll go ahead and click on that. It's going to ask you for the project name, the folder, and the CVU IP address. So always remember to change the name because if you don't change the name, then whatever you edit is going to stay in whenever you create a new LabVIEW project because it's going to change the default. So I'm going to name it Tutorial 1. And XXYY is the IP address of your team. In my case, it's 1514, so 10.15142, and click finish. I already created one, we'll overwrite it. Okay, so it's gonna create the project for you. And what it's gonna open up is called the Project Explorer. Uh, that's what it's called, the Project Explorer window. Show you in a while. It takes a while for it to load. It's taking a lot more time. Uh, anticipated Okay, so I think it's done. <clears throat> okay, so this is called the Project Explorer window. Here's the title that you name. All your code that you're gonna edit during the season is gonna be under Team Code right here. It has begin and everything. We'll talk about that after. And all that file can all of those files, VIs, can be found in one single file called robot main. If you're familiar with Java, main is like public static word main, like it puts everything together. And this uh, window is really important because if you want to deploy your code permanently on the robot, you have to go under build specifications and then build and then run a startup and deploy and whatnot. So I'm going to go ahead, click on robot main and open it. So this window right here is called the front panel window and this is where it's mostly like visual like um, camera or toggle switches, images, and all of the things that are output like in Java you know the output um, screen at the bottom this is basically what it is it's more visual if you press control E or you go window and uh, show block diagram this is where like if you want to call it the code is and so as you can see all the files that were found in Project Explorer begin and tell you off they're all right here begin tell you off terminus okay so I'm just gonna b briefly tell you that begin is for initializing so if you want to write it down or something begin you initialize your hardware tell you off is where you utilize your hardware. Autonomous, you utilize the hardware, but the robot has to do it by itself. I'm sure you already know that. And this is just for good programming practice. Whenever you open something and begin, always in finish, close it. 
and yeah so ne in the next video I'll be talking about in more detail of the actual coding of the basic drivetrain and what the basic code provides that FRC gives you so see you in the next tutorial